vlog this is going in, but my in-laws bought me a TV for my birthday. Thank you, Mom and Dad. Smart TV, I'm very excited about it because our current TV is a smart TV, but it's a very old smart TV. So it only has like a few apps and it honestly has been crapping out on us. This one has everything. It has everything. plants that you know were there before back I don't actually have a planter for this one and I haven't since I got it so maybe I need to go get one and I have that one and I like liked it at first but I don't really like it that much anymore um, I feel like it looks like it should be outside you know anyways so I used to have um, a painting or not a painting but like an art piece right here and now that the walls are white I don't like it there anymore because it's like a white painting with a light gray or like creamish artwork on it and because the wall's white it looks just super boring versus when the wall was brown it was a nice contrast so I didn't put it back up I don't know what I'm gonna do with it um, but I put my hats here and I feel like that's kind of nice um, this is a perfect spot for another plant like if I wanted to put either another shelf or a hanging plant but I'm just gonna leave my hats for now it's just on two command hooks and then I clean this up this area always gets super messy just cuz like everyday stuff goes on on our dresser but um that's that and then I didn't put anything back up here yet because I did have a hanging uh, spider plant but uh, because it was up there, I kept not watering it. So I don't know if I actually want to put it back up there, but I'm going to have to put some stuff back up there. Uh, and then this painting goes up here. I did put this up here, but I didn't put the blinds back in yet. If you can see, it's still bare. So I don't know if I'm going to leave this here because obviously it would be in the way if I left um, or if I put the blinds back. So I don't know. I hate those blinds. They're so old and ugly. So I don't know. I don't know. The only thing is that when it's nighttime and the light's on, you can see directly into our bathroom. Can you see how much of a difference it makes now that this wall is white? Isn't that so crazy? 
and I know it's like first world problems but now when I take selfies from here the walls are white versus I could rarely ever take selfies in here because the walls were so dark and then when I edit my photos my photos are a little bit warm so it would make the brown wall more orange and red so anyways I like it I don't know if I showed you guys, but this is the TV. I have to take like the tape off and stuff. This is the TV that my in-laws bought me. I'm obsessed with it. I love it. So I ended up putting a curtain here and I wanted a sheer one because I still wanted a lot of light coming in and I didn't want to like close off the room but I did need something for privacy because we didn't put the blinds back and one morning someone like our building is getting painted I think I, I might have mentioned <laughs> And someone was like right next to our window literally looking into our I mean they weren't looking in but they were literally like their head was right here we were sleeping in the bed it was just so uncomfortable so that morning we literally went to Target and was like okay we need to get um, a curtain just to get some privacy but I kind of showed you putting up the curtains and I didn't drill it into the wall because I don't since we're renting I don't want to drill more than we need to so I actually use command hooks so because this curtain is sheer and it's super thin it's really light we used command hooks to secure the dowel what is it called the rod so each one I think is like seven and a half pounds that it carries but I definitely didn't need all three because I don't even think this is more than two pounds but Tommy suggested that we just put three just to be extra safe so I did that and then I'm not sure if I showed you guys the other day but I ended up putting this like cord hider obviously you can still see the cord it's kind of meant for like behind desks and behind entertainment centers but to me it still looks way better than the black cord just like dangling and being free so although it's not the most inconspicuous thing and it doesn't hide the cord 100% that's how I needed to do it because this TV does like move and swivel so I needed to have some slack for if we wanted to pull the TV out or turn it or anything like that so the room is pretty much done especially with these curtains in here it looks super good. I don't know if I showed you guys, but I ended up command stripping this, what is this, AC remote holder to the wall because we kept losing this AC remote because it's so small, but also because Noah just likes to do whatever he wants with it. So I put it right there for safekeeping. All right, that's going to be it for today's video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed this little room update. I am obsessed changing the paint was such a small thing but made a huge difference don't forget to subscribe down below turn on post notifications give this video a big thumbs up and go ahead and follow me on instagram for more photos of this room update thanks guys bye